Hi guys, welcome to a new video. Today we're going to be doing my top five courses on Skillshare. So Skillshare is an online learning community with over 17,000 courses in photography, design, video, and for the reason I use it, lettering. There are some great letterers who are teaching classes on there. There's John Contino, Jessica Hitch, uh, Martina Fleur, many others, uh, and loads of courses to refine your skills in both typography and lettering. I've been using Skillshare for the past four years, and I love coming back to this platform because I really enjoy learning more about new techniques, uh, new skills, new styles, and just generally getting to see the process of letterers that I admire and respect in this creative industry. Premium membership to Skillshare gives you unlimited access to improve your skills, unlock new opportunities, and just to do the work you love. Skillshare believes in accessible learning and the price reflects that. An annual subscription with unlimited access is less than $10 a month, making it one of the best deals you can find for online education. Since Skillshare are sponsoring this video, the first 100 people to use the promo link in the description below will get their first two months free to try it out risk-free. So let's get into my top five. First up, we have Hand Lettering Essentials by Mary Kate McDivitt. This was one of the first courses that I enrolled in when I first signed up to Skillshare. Mary Kate is a legend in the lettering community. In her course, she goes through finding inspiration, putting together mood boards, uh, thumbnail sketches and the importance of those, refining your sketches, and then inking your sketches and then finalizing your artwork so it's ready to be scanned into the computer. She also has lots of other courses on there uh, going through the stages of taking onto the computer and loading texture and color to uh, looking into sort of more vintage designs as well. So worth checking out that one. At number two, we have Lettering for Designers, One Drop Cap Left Form at a Time by Jessica Hitch. In this class, letterer Jessica Hitch takes you through the process of designing your own drop cap. This starts with researching and sketching your ideas, refining those drawings to taking them onto the computer and digitising them. It's great to see Jessica's process, especially when she takes her work into Adobe Illustrator. She gives some great tips and tricks for uh, drawing your work digitally. And number three, we have customising type, creating word marks that work with designer Aaron Draplin. I'm a massive fan of Draplin's work, so I was really excited when this course was announced. He's got a couple of courses on Skillshare, but this particular one focuses on discovering reference material, kerning, owning that space between the letters, customising letter forms, sketching type from scratch, preparing a file for print, whether that's for you doing it for a client or whether that's for your own artwork. He also has this bonus segment where he shows three different ways to add texture to your type and rebuilding typefaces from scratch. And number four, we have the comprehensive guide to hand lettering with Eric Marinovich. In his course, he goes through things like where to get ideas from, looking at stuff around you like street signs and shop signs. He looks at a section with lettering stroke basics and also combining two different lettering styles. So he's looking at condensed lettering paired with uh, script lettering. Then he looks at layout and composition and he finally touches on shadowing, shading and outlining. The whole class is based around producing a hand lettered envelope. So it's something very personal and practical that you end up with. So the last one, number five, is brush pen logo design develop your own signature style with Matt Vergottis. So Matt is a great lettering artist. In his class, you go through the process of creating your very own brush pen signature style logo. He runs through the tools that he uses and goes into detail of how he uses them. He gives you helpful, practical techniques to get familiar with the brush pen and also building up that muscle memory that's really important with this style of brush lettering. He is also a left-hander, so offers some great advice for those struggling to do brush grip with their left hand. He also shows you how to use a pencil to achieve the same brush script style lettering. Finally, he looks at composition and then taking your work onto the computer to create a nice smooth vector version of your lettering. So that's my top five. I have others that I love as well. Please let me know if you've got any that you've done that have been really helpful and really useful. I'll also leave a link to my profile on Skillshare so you can see some of the projects that I've done and some are there from like about four years ago so you can see how I've progressed as well. Don't forget to click on the promo link in the description below and get those two months free and try it out. You will learn so much in those two months. Thank you for Skillshare for sponsoring this video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't, and I'll see you in the next one.